guys, it's me, the creator of the art in this video. But I just want to say this is highly inspired by Sona Draws stuff. If you check her out, she's really cool. She she draws stuff like the name suggests. <laughs> Anyways, let's get on with the video. So today we're going to be drawing Roblox stereotypes that you see every day. And we're going to start off by drawing the aesthetic stereotype. When I think of aesthetic on Roblox, I think of the white hat with the butterfly on it you know that i'll put a picture on screen and like the brown shimmering hair you know that i'll put another picture on screen uh but those are some like things aesthetic people wear a lot for some reason they also wear like the the freckle face i have no idea like why they do it they just wear the freckle face a lot and there's nothing wrong with aesthetic people i actually quite like the style but I, d I just don't know why, uh, I, don't, I don't know why they, like, all wear the same items. Like, come on, put some flavor in it. Put some flavor in, in the, in the, in the, in the, in the. <laughs> so, I guess just enjoy the music. You, but I really like how this turned out. I really love um, the hat. I, <laughs> you, you know, gotta give myself some self credit, you know. Um, I love it. Very cute. I like it. I end up not giving her the freckle face. But, but um, just do with it. Okay, so now on to the next tile. We have the copy and paste. And right now I'm just um, putting some reference pictures so I know how, like what to go off. So I don't really know what to do with the pose, but I'll figure that out later. Um, it's like, um, I don't know what to really say, except I'm not going with this pose. I ended up changing it, FYI. Um, yeah. So, oh yeah, okay, so like, for this pose, I made her like, gonna be holding a bomb, cause you know like, the copy and paste in Ragdoll Engine, they like, have the bomb, and they push people over, and they put the bomb on the people, and it's so annoying, and they send you flying, and it's just really annoying, yeah, just a detail I wanted to add into it, so yeah, um, I'm actually quite liking the pose so far. It's not the most original pose, like, but I quite like it actually. So we're just gonna speed it up a little bit more. 
I'm giving it a stitched face, which is like obviously so, um, I don't want to say overused, but yeah, overused. And right here, <laughs> I got up to pee. So how'd you guys this day? Tell me in the comments. Tell me if you like this kind of content, because I like making it. Um, okay, yes, I'm back now, and I'm, notice that all the copy and paste, they have, like, really messy black hair, so I gave them messy black hair, and for the clothes, keeping it really simple, just a cropped shirt with some high-waisted ripped jeans, and I guess with nothing more to say, enjoy the music. farewell message as they signed off stay hungry stay
like the Titanic, ice blue, like the Atlantic, and I'm going down, like the Titanic, ice blue, like the Atlantic, and I'm going down, like the Titanic, ice blue, like the Atlantic, and I'm going down, like the Titanic, like the Atlantic, and I'm going down, like the Titanic. Okay guys, I really like this one, and I had a lot of fun with it, because this was my first time drawing ripped jeans and explosions, and it was really fun. I should draw explosions more. <laughs> so the next stereotype is the emo type stereotype. Um, I really like the end of the result of this one. Um, yeah, enjoy the music.
Okay guys, I really like the outcome of this. It looks really eerie and creepy, but I really like it. Yeah. Alright guys, here are the three results. I really like it, and I hope you do too. Don't forget to like and subscribe, uh, and see you next video.